especially in Sweden, I think, because Sweden is uh, too small a country to actually compete between each other, especially where you don't have a direct uh, comp uh, competition climate or a competing climate or competing products. Uh, we really need to work together. And, you know, if everyone goes together, we can do a lot more with less. I think there are certain industries that uh, are in Sweden today that works in uh, similar fields, but they don't compete. So if you take uh, aerospace once again, or the turbine industry, like if you have Siemens and GKN, they can collaborate without any problems. Um, and really be smart, I mean, from an owner perspective, because you know, you see ABB, Atlas Copco, Ericsson, these companies, but if you look at the, the overall owner structure, there are some high level uh, owners that can actually, you know, realize that they can centralize some parts of what they're doing and uh, spread it throughout the, the different companies. I think my leadership style is very much, you know, being curious and trying new things. So I never stop and I never think that oh, I already know this, whatever. Just get my head in there, try to understand what's going on. Um, and also with the people I work with, I have the same approach that, you know, it's okay to fail. Though, I mean, do like I do. <laughs> Uh, the last two months, I would say, even though it's not a super technical thing, I would say it's that General Electric did buy Swedish Arcam, uh, which is a manufacturer in Gothenburg of electron beam uh, melting systems. So uh, that was really interesting to see that such a big uh, international company buys a Swedish startup company, even though they were not really a startup anymore. but. Um, and, you know, to some extent being uh, curious about that and trying to understand how is that going to influence the market, what are their strategies and ideas going forward, uh, because it's going to have a huge influence to anyone who's working in additive manufacturing when a big player suddenly makes an aggressive move like that.